So if y'all can yeah. look on to Twitter and let us know who you think is going to win this game. Tweet hashtag enemy win or hashtag TIP win to at LOL Esports. Try and code chance in the audience. Team Impulse, but here comes the rest of the team. Xiao Wei Xiao is missing exhaust. The hook doesn't quite land, but still, the walk oh, no. play. The Q lands from Rek'Sai, and Xiao Wei Xiao stays alive. Flares in a bad spot. Kill goes over to Impact. The misplay died for the chase. Inox gets the kill with his Ignite. Xiao Wei Xiao still nearly dead, and maybe there's enough damage. Inox on the hunt goes for a little bit more, but it's a one for one. It's a team that stayed that gets Dragon, and that Four minutes ago could have been enemy esports. Trashy is the biggest difference in this game. It's actually 500 gold right there. Gank in the top lane. Uh, exhaust is good. Flay is good as well. Impact does not have any summoners. He used it in the initial brawl. That means a kill over to Otter and it equalizes the gold here, equalizes the farm lead. Game we'd see last week. Absolutely the case, but here we go. Impact getting caught up here. He's only level four, which means he could die fast. Trashy getting caught up. He's level six. Oh, Inox dies in for the kill, but the knock has been Yasuo says hello, and Xiao Wei Xiao answers back. Adrian gets the kill credit, but out goes the rest of enemy esports trying to stay alive. Another knockup lands, won't get a kill, but a one for one trade, then a better one for Impulse. Has a knockup available. Fighter up does not land the hook, but that's going to be a great tornado. A lot of damage to the enemy esports support, and the kill will go through. Ken, enemy trade back. Xiao Wei Xiao, the javelin hits, and in comes Flares. Charging with the ulti, a second kill picked up. Enemy winning the fight so far, but Rush with a great explosive cast knocks him right back in. A two for two. Enemy Esports on the retreat. Bit of a flank move onto the top side because Flares is already here to fight. Impact does have Flash, still no ulti. Impact is still level five. Flashes for no effect at all. Great kill picked up again for Enemy Esports. ABTP in for this dragon. Looks like there's not going to be an attempt from Enemy Esports. And Dragon number two goes to Team Impulse. Now, Impact over and over again. And speaking of, Impact has the ulti. The first one of the game helps his enemy team jungle. Still getting chunked out by Apollo. He really wants this, but that's a bit greedy. Uh, yeah, he wanted the farm. It all right. Not worth the 34 gold. Yeah, that was rough there. Apollo actually getting a sneaky amount of power here. Trinity Force and Sork Shoes completed. Nice wind wall. Has to, wow. Oh, this is both their soul winners basically getting losing the turret to just a Corky. Uh, maybe Rush is going to overstep though as well. Both these teams playing a little bit too hard. Rumble Eagler comes in from well over the wall, but Otter gets the kill onto Rush. Impact Ooh, still not no. exactly scary. Flares has ulti if they want to fight anymore. Adrian goes for the engage on Anox, gets nothing forward except the kill on a body drop. Adrian will lose his life. Both supports dead. Flares does turn one back around, but in comes Apollo. Summoner heal keeps him alive. A double kill so far for Otter. Make that a triple kill. Actually, one goes over to Inox. But a big lead for enemy esports off that. Xiao Wei Xiao is out of flow and he's soloing this dragon here. Low on health gets the solo kill though. And here comes the engage. Rush looking for the nice knockups come in. Where will the fight start? Body drop's gonna be the first kill. This one. Fear comes in towards Rush and a Xiao Wei Xiao. Whoa! Who gets the last breath in time. Doesn't get any kills for it though. It's gonna be still three coming into. Uh, overall for Team Impulse, just enough damage dealt. Otter forced to run, but he's got nowhere to go. Rush with the barrel, nice anchor from Adrian, a double kill for Impact, he's back in the game. And Impulse got the team fight they wanted. We know why that was the type of team comp they're playing, and they found the fight. Oh, what a good fight by Team Impulse, just barely landing. This game from the Team Impulse mid laner, knocks up Trashy, looking to yeah, keep the movement speed up with Phage, and he's doing a great job for it, going right to Infinity Edge after Phage, so. Just getting it for the stats it provides. Goes for the ulti in on the trash. He might just solo out this Rek'Sai and does so. Xiao Wei Xiao making a lot of big plays. He's not Naka. done. He wants to kill everybody here. Looks for honor. Right, Can't done. quite do it, but exhaust and summoner heal. Everything used to keep him alive. <laughs> Even if it doesn't look good at first, he will always try and make the big play. He's so comfortable on that champion. The pressure he drew down into the bottom lane. Now with the Baron, they can get that middle inhibitor cracked open. The turret is down. Like they won, he had a good rumble ulti down to begin with. Another time for the bottom lane here. Chaplin won't quite land, but it forces the teleport from Impact here. In comes Trash. The fight is still on. And Xiao Wei Xiao, of course, very low equalizer comes across. One kill picked up. Xiao Wei Xiao lands the knockup, goes for Inox. Is it going to be enough? The Zonia's pop means there's going to be some trade damage back through. But I don't think from Adrian going to buy some time. The Ren doesn't quite kill, but a Hurricane Bolt does. A two for zero in favor of enemy esports. A great hook off the Fates call will knock in Adrian. Trashy picks up a kill as well. His fifth of the game. And now Enemy Esports the team with the lead. Could get pushed in. In fact, Enemy Esports going for the play on the Xiao Wei Xiao. Bit of damage dealt. He puts the wind wall in. The rest of Impulse now on the chase, but where is Flares gonna be? And it's a 5v4 with Otter getting caught out. Flashes the wall, takes a ton of damage, and Adrian gets the kill credit. Recall from the Hecarim, but it's a five versus three. Impulse in complete control. Ready to push even farther in. 
it's the damnedest thing about watching Team Impulse play. They make a huge mistake and then they'll follow it up with a really nice play. Uh, this one was again Shao Wei Shao creating an opportunity in the mid lane. Yeah. And now it's Dragon number four. We thought that the four to five Dragons would be a major win condition for Team Impulse right here. And they see Enox, they see Flares. He's attempted to engage. Xiao Wei Xiao has used his tornado. There's one Q, there's two. He's got the knock up one more time. He can land it on a Flares, does so, doesn't pop the ulti. Body drop, gonna go for the flash. A great wind wall by Xiao Wei Xiao keeps him alive. Team Baron already started. Gonna force the recall into teleport yeah. from Flares. Trying orb in, they can throw a Thresh in there as well. It's basically about peeling for a fight. But Trash, he's already dead before the fight even begins. And the equalizer is great to buy a lot of time. More kills come through as slaughter. Over to enemy esports. Three kills picked up. The hook's gonna not mean much on a double kill for Xiao Wei Xiao. This could be game indeed, chat. Ten seconds ago until anyone respawns from the lineup. Otherwise, it is a one versus five. Inox just now getting the recall off. Being chased out by Xiao Wei Xiao. The recalls come in. The respawns are here. And it's gonna be just an inhibitor turret. That could have been Baron. Enemy is trying to force a mistake here, but it looks like they may be making the mistake themselves. Well, there's a bit of time without the AD carry or the top lane, about 10 seconds until those guys join in. Baron's still getting attempted here. Body drop losing a lot of health. The engage comes in towards Otter. Rush doing a lot of damage here. Xiao Wei Xiao exhausted and running now into the fight. He's going to land the ulti onto one. The shutdown comes in. Xiao Wei Xiao is dead. And how well can the team kite? Otter is alive. Two kills already. But here comes Apollo with a vengeance, trying to get the kill on the opposing AD carry. That will go Impulse's way. Inox and Trashy, only two alive versus three still members of Team Impulse. That is a one fight, but Inox has some poke. I mean, esports have to stop Dragon 5. They go right away. Impulse are here, though. Righteous Glory pop. Oh. Here comes the engage. Smite comes through. Oh. Picked up by Rush. Dragon 5 is in. Flare's gonna die to the fire. And Inox now also jumped on. Has nowhere to go. Three kills already picked up. And Impulse, with a minion wave in the mid lane, could maybe look for the win. The straw that breaks the camel's back may have been a nice smite right there by Rush. So desperate of enemy. They really wanted to avoid the fifth dragon. So they end up trying to force a fight without prep, which is exactly what Impulse wanted in the first place. Then you get the fact that Impulse got the dragon smite for the fifth dragon. And this is going to be game. This time. This one for, this sure. one for sure, yeah. Unless there's some kind of crazy misstep. This will be it. Shao Wei Shao with the wind wall to really buy a lot of time for his team. The last turret goes down, 12 seconds on the respawns here, and Team Impulse will improve their record to 500. Four and four, sole position in sixth place. Congratulations to Team Impulse.